Clarified early this morning around 1.30 a.m. Police were called here for an assault and robbery after that victim was picked up by an alleged Uber. The victim tells police he ordered an Uber from the valet area of Horseshoe Casino. Right from the start, the alleged Uber driver headed in the wrong direction. And when the victim started asking questions, the driver pulled over. That's when another vehicle showed up and five to six men armed with guns approached, ordering the victim out of the car and demanding his cell phone after striking him several times. The suspects then got back into their cars and drove away. Um, it's a little uh, shocking because I think I personally use Uber to get home safely, so it's kind of the opposite of what I want. 45 minutes later in Baltimore County, another Uber related crime, this time an alleged robbery and kidnapping in the middle of a Pikesville neighborhood. The victim says they requested an Uber. When the vehicle pulled up, the victim went to approach the vehicle. At that time, they were approached by multiple suspects and demanded to get into the vehicle. Once inside the vehicle, the suspects then drove the victim around to multiple locations and attempt to get them to retrieve money from an ATM. Uber tells WBAL TV in a statement, quote, the safety of riders and drivers is paramount at Uber, and these reports are deeply concerning. We have a 24-7 team standing by to help with police investigations, and we look forward to supporting Baltimore area law enforcement however we can. Uber and police both say riders should always double check the details of their ride before getting in. Make sure that the individual that is pictured on your Uber app is the individual that's actually picking you up. Verify what type of car it is, matching up with the color and the license plate. And just again, if you can, let somebody know that you're getting an Uber where you actually are located and just kind of work that buddy system. Some more safety tips from Uber. Press the in-app emergency assistance button in the safety toolkit to reach 911 directly. Make sure to designate trusted contacts in the app. And once a trip starts, you can use the share my trip feature to show your driver's name, photo, license plate and location with a friend or family member who can then follow the trip in real time. Detective Trey Corbin says that police are investigating these crimes and that includes combing through surveillance video. Live in Baltimore, I'm Tommy Clark, WBAL TV 11 News.